Hi, just wanted to make a quick video and share with you something that we've been working on. We've been trying to find a way of adding a desk into the real-time scene and um, having it so that the hands don't penetrate through. Uh, with the help from Ramper, from the Realusion support team, uh, we've managed to set this up. So the way this was done is by turning um, whatever object you have into a terrain and then making sure that you've got the hand contact uh, hand contact uh, selected so the hand won't pass through that terrain object so it gives you some nice little effects so you know things like I could add a, a mouse in and just have the um, have that attach to the hand and have that moving on the desk um, you know we've got like, tapping on the desk and then you can as you can see here like this sphere object yeah you know, the hands won't pass through um, when doing your animation um, it just works really nice for um, like I say live presenter type stuff and the other cool thing is um, any physics objects that you have in the scene. So if you had something on the desk, you'd be able to knock it off or do things like that. So I thought I'd quickly just show an example of um, adding a physics object in so that we can like kind of... So this uh, cylinder here, we can knock it off. Um, this is done by... If you look on the hand... I've linked a ball object and added um, a kinematic uh, physics object. So this will interact with um, any ob other objects that have physics on them. And then I'll just hide that. So that is part of the mesh. And then we can do things like that, which is quite cool. So we're going to be playing around a little bit more with... Um, physics in real time with the Rococo suit. Um, I'm going to be looking at the popcorn effects uh, library soon. I'm going to be playing around with things like fur and um, fire and rain and all that type of stuff and see what we can do and add it into a real time um, environment for doing live uh, presentations with the Rococo suit as well. So here we go. Let's see how far I can get this thing. <laughs> okay. That was rubbish. But still, um, just um, testing it all out now, but I can see some really cool stuff, really good potential um, for creating live shows. So I'm trying to hit this without hitting my monitor. That's in front of me at the moment. So we'll be uh, making some more videos soon. Okay. So before I go, I thought I'd just add a few more physics props um, into the real-time animation and just see what it does. I think I can actually bat some of these things flowing out of my head away if I can hit them. So, as you can see, the potential in this is pretty great. I mean, we can add in fire, rain, um, put lots of props on the table, build up some things. So, um, we're going to just keep um, experimenting with this and seeing what we can do, but definitely think. It's got some potential. I'm trying to hit the ball and the cylinder, but without knocking things off my desk at the same time. So, um, yeah. Really fun stuff. So, um, yeah, we're definitely going to be uh, testing this out a little bit more. 